Hi guys! Today I'm just going to walk you through how to use this word problem graphic organizer to help you solve word problems. So I won't actually be solving the word problem, I just want to show you how to use the graphic organizer when you're in Google Slides. So when you get to your Google Slide, you will see a word problem right here. It is editable, so be sure to be careful when you're typing that you don't want to mess up the word problem. But what you can do is read the word problem and then use these text boxes to write the parts of the word problem that the graphic organizer is asking for. So the word problem says, a construction crew is painting lines on the sides of a new highway. In one week, they are supposed to have 67 and a half miles completed. On Monday, they painted 13 and 5 six miles. On Tuesday, they painted 12 and 1 third miles. How many more miles are left to paint? So here I would type, how many more miles are left to paint because that's the question I am trying to figure out. In the action word box, I would write down any action words that help me solve the problems. Words that maybe are words like difference, how many more, left over, things like that. So I would write down completed. I think that would help me solve. I would also type out how many more. I think left is a good action word. And I think that's good for right now as I look over. Of course, you can always add more when you get to your assignment if you feel like you need to add more. Now, in this model box, it says use the drawing and shape tools to draw a model. You can delete this text to create your model. So I would delete that. And depending on how I wanted to solve, I could use these shape features to create models of what I wanted to show. Maybe I actually want to draw out some sort of sidewalk and create something, or maybe I just want to use, um, I can even insert a table to show fractions, something like that, and I can make the table really small if it's something I wanted to put into my model. And then I can use this little paint can here to fill in certain boxes to show fractions. So it's up to you on how you want to show that model. Here is where I would type out the equation I actually used to solve. So maybe I'm going to be adding these numbers together, or maybe I'm subtracting whatever it is. I'm just going to randomly put those numbers in there so you can see how I would just type in my answer. Finally, I want to explain my thinking about solving this word problem. So I would choose one of those sentence frames and I would type my answer in this box. I found the answer by, and I would explain what I did. I wouldn't actually put those lines, I would type out what I did. So this was just a quick overview to show you how to use this graphic organizer when you're solving a word problem. It's meant to help you organize your thoughts and make sure that you are really deconstructing that word problem and understanding it. All right, thank you so much. Be sure to like this video and subscribe at the end. Thank you guys.